Um, and so, um, but you two are heading out? I'm not, I'm gonna, like, chill around for a little bit longer. Okay, you said Claudius is... Well, if no one else is, I'll go watch the people get stabbed. Okay. (laughs) Where is Rina? Rina's outside of the tattoo shop. I was making money earlier. Yeah. So everyone's at the tattoo shop. Um, tattoos. Tattoos. Oh, actually, I'm gonna go over to the, um, anything signed shop. Mm-hmm. Cool. I want to get some false documents and see. I want to check prices for false documents. Okay. And so you you step on in and they have it's mostly inks and quills and different like sets that are around and there is a a gentleman with very tiny glasses. It's a halfling gentleman with very tiny glasses Mm -hmm. standing at the front and he peers up at you and uh, may I help you? Hey, I'm looking for a, uh, <laughs> mm, I'm pricing it. How much would a summons from the king cost? Uh, are you trying to get into court? Just the palace. Then that might be a bit pricey for just getting into the palace. Although, it'll run you about 45 gold. Hmm. It'll get you past the guards, at least. Uh, all right. Not today. All right. Hopefully another time. Keep in mind, it's hard to get the seal. Unfortunately, that's the problem. Straight up cowboy. All right. I'm going to skirt out of the shop. Okay. All right. And so... He's the king in the background. So, what is everyone doing at this point? Okay. Just raise your hand if you're done shopping. I just want you to know that I thought you were going to say it's very small eyes. So, Aaron goes, oh, the googly eyes. Like, imagine this man goes, what can I do for you? And the one pops off, he just picks another one up. Okay, okay yeah, I finished with that. With that. So everybody meets up. Okay. So everyone kind of meets up after everyone has gotten tattooed. And And some of y'all aren't feeling super hot. Although tattoos are super hot. (laughs) Rina. Yes. Some merchants pointed out. Did we talk to the grave man before? That we say goodbye to the death man? Grave man. Grave man, before we leave. Yes, uh, follow me. We'll go out the way we came in. So you're gonna do it. That's okay. And drink the tea. You're gonna be fine. And you step through that door, and you know, you've seen, like, throughout the day, you've seen people kind of coming and going through that door, and it's. It seems like, especially because everyone kind of dispersed at the same time, you kind of figured they'd all gather up at the same time, but people have been coming and going in very, like, just weird times and just weird, like, just different clothes and different, like, people just constantly through the day, but all with these masks. And so you guys go ahead and you enter into the door at the same time, really, as someone else does, but it's just the six of you in the room with the grave man. And he looks up and, have you come to have tea with the grave man? Yes. And he sets out six cups and pours tea and s- sits back. Boom. Knock it back. Bang, Turns bang. in, like, does the rope thing. Mm-hmm. And, like, picks it up. And then drinks it. Okay. I didn't think about that. Really, but and that's a thing he's got to do. <laughs> and he very carefully, like, puts all the cups away and... It's always a pleasure when the grave man's friends come. And I'm going to hand him a gold. And then he just grins and... Thank you for your generosity. And you for your patience. I like hosting friends. And he takes the fold and sets it out of sight. Can I do an insight check on him? Mm-hmm. Can I borrow your tray? Oh, God, you're so close to getting out of your safe. <laughs> Uh, 18. Um, 
there's definitely something <laughs> otherworldly about him, but you you don't like you can't quite tell how old he is. You can't tell like where he's from. Right. He's the witch he doctor. Just, he just he just <laughs> seems like he's kind of like built into the house almost. And he just kind of nods at you all as you head towards the opposite door. Nice. And you step out of the house into a completely different area of town than when you went into it. (laughs) And you turn around and there's actually just a bakery behind you. Nice. Does it smell Uh, good? Yeah. The bakery, it smells great. Fucking Howl's Moving Castle door. (gasps) Yes. Oh, oh it's it's good. Good. So, is it <clears throat> find anything cool? Step, step, step. <laughs> Everyone is kind of. What did you say? Uh, what time is it? It is now like after sunset. It is dark. Lamps are lit. Like you can see, like the evening crowd kind of milling around, and and it was like daytime ish. So you went from daytime to in a house to suddenly it's nighttime. Nice. That's. I'm a little creeped out. It's very spooky. Very magical. A good time with the grave man. Alright, I'm calling bullshit. You two don't like magic. Explain this. Metaphysical. Metaphysical. (laughs) This is different. What do you mean it's different? It's the same exact thing. You literally just drank poison. Magic poison. Metaphysical poison. That's not... it's, It's just poison, not metaphysical poison. No, friend. It's metaphysical poison. You're okay. speaking to someone who works in the metaphysical. Okay. And poison. And poison. <laughs> but also, the metaphysical makes me hella money. So. So it doesn't matter as long as you profit from it. So why oh. are you such a scaredy cat? Excuse you. You drink metaphysical, like metaphysical poison, you pop in and out of doors all over the city, and yet one little firebolt goes off and you're losing your mind. I don't watch people do it. You just did for hours. Well, that's Roll different. perception? No, set up a pitch. Who? Everybody. Um, everybody. Oops. You're outside on the street. Oh, I've been uh, saying metaphysical, thank 20. you very much. I was just trying to do flavor text. 13. Yeah. Natural. Uh, you can... Uh, Claudius, you do see a couple people kind of... Starting to slow down as she's talking. I, have no I sense wouldn't plug. say those words up in here. Metaphysical. It's science, you people. Bitch. Science. They don't. And they're like frowning at you and like murmuring to themselves. People she are just scared of them off. But they don't. Uh, <sighs> Excellent it's choice, like lady. <laughs> Can we start to adjourn back to the inn, perhaps? Sure. I don't think it's it's like smart. Two. Got things to go, people to do. Anyone find anything oh, good? Hoarding, hoarding. And so you guys are kind of meandering no. back. No. I, I lost <laughs> good things. Wait, what did you say? Anyone find anything good? It's just not gonna happen, my guy. Yeah. I got some sick ink, bro. <laughs> I did. I had someone work on my tattoo for me. I think I'm fucking poisoned, so. How, how many of you got developed? tattoos? <laughs> yeah. I got some work. You just keep looking down at your own wound, like, oh, yeah, studying. I'm, like, bruised <laughs> everywhere <laughs> on my shoulder. It's, like, this whole part. Sick. Yeah. I'm going to have to heal I'm myself gonna... later. Assume I'm wearing long sleeves of some kind. Mm-hmm. Probably. Yeah, because it would... The same outfit that you were wearing, so. Yeah, so mine's covered. Okay. Is it known that any of that, like, remember, had tattoos? I don't know. I don't think. No, I know, because you. No, because yeah. well, well, you kept it covered. You swim yeah. in a river together, though. Uh, Times wasn't that bad. Did you swim in a river with your tattoos completely covered? I don't think I actually got it. You guys got yeah. in the bathe and then remember made oh, a big wait, deal no, about you that. Mm-hmm. You did because. You put hist on your yeah. head. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. So I didn't actually get it. So I, she has had it from the beginning when I made the character. She's had tattoos this entire time. But this is definitely the first time anybody's seen it. Yeah. Because she ain't walking around. Well, she has a tit out, but she doesn't have like. She doesn't like that. She has a tit out, not a tat out. Hey. Tit for tat. I really thought she was gonna ask for like them to tattoo like a nipple on her or something. Like a mastectomy. Or like just like a U shape. 
exactly. You just like apply. <laughs> you draw it out every morning so, with a marker. Like, so you guys go ahead and you <laughs> make your way back through the tavern, and Rita kind of is like, "Oh, okay, actually, we're on this side of town." And so she like guides you guys back to the tavern, um, where you know things are definitely more lively. Like people have come in for dinner. There's a bigger performance kind of going on. And um, hold on. When you forget their name and then you close your book. When the plot hits your eyes. <laughs> when you go hey, you your eyes. Okay, you'll that's it. it and so, <laughs> and so Tamar kind of like waves at you as you come in. Like he's going around to the different tables and serving people. And you guys, do you hang out down here? Or do you go up to the rooms that you have keys for? I'm going up to a room. I'm gonna so. get food and bring it up with me so I can feed my boy. Okay. Who's um, it's going to be one silver. Yeah. And grab the keys. Could I have a key? Who are you rooming with? Well, I mean, I you can steal. have one, but don't steal it. Mm -hmm. I know you think with keys. If I stole it, then I wouldn't be able to get in the room now, would I? Don't steal it, because you'd have it. <laughs> Sprays in face with water. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. <laughs> and then I take my key. Stephanie, I assume you're going with me. Alright, I might not. I'm going to do a thing and then I'm going to leave. And then what? I'll hand the other one, what I guess. What? what do you do? <laughs> You'll find out. And um, the room that has the Goliath size bed. Yeah. It, act, it has a Goliath size bed, but to fit the Goliath size bed, there's just a halfling size bed in the other part of the room. So it's gonna have to be. Hell yeah, <laughs> buddy camp. Pepper and Jumson. Remember, like, is very quiet when she looks at the bed and, like, Aww. is mildly <laughs> emotional about it. Times <laughs> in, like, goes through, and then he stops himself and he's like, because he was, like, he saw how massive the bed was, and he too was like, I've never seen such a massive bed. Like I could swim in that thing, <laughs> but like he, right, he, he like stops and stuff. And he's like, oh yeah, that's 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 remembers bed. Um, okay, <laughs> just goes and like checks out the small bed. Very wholesome. We are Eloise at the Plaza. In <gasps> yes. <laughs> yes. Oh. So Athena's gonna like when she locks the doors and like closes all the drapes and stuff like that is going to feed her boy, but then she's gonna like razz him like you do a dog so he gets the zoomies. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And so he's gonna let you do the skittery thing. Oh yeah, he's like bolting oh, like across the floor, and he like darts under the bed with some oh, of the food, darts back out, grabs the food, and then at one point he just swaps to boy form, and he's just sitting there eating. Yeah. Okay, I'm trying to like tire him out for the. Gonna knock at her door. I um, pull a blanket off the bed. Okay. Lay down on uh, the floor. Who? So, Thames in and remember. About Safine. Safine or, and Ingrid, and then Claudius and Rena. Okay. And so you are lay down on the floor. Okay. And pull a blanket off the bed. There are two. There are two beds in the room, yeah. right? Yeah. Fall asleep. And Rena's like, the oh. oh, So Rena, Rena goes get and gets the, the other bed. <laughs> <laughs> and she's like, well, so you're not gonna use it. I'm so you just hear this. <laughs> Rinna drags the bed, like, she kind of, like, moves you, Claudius, and she's, yeah, like, like, she's, like, a little bit. she's, like, come on, like, stop, she's, like, stop it, as she, like, drags the other bed over, and now you have, I like, have two beds. Oh, but I have to take my, I take my cloak off to sleep, by the way, too. So, <laughs> so, you see, should probably know at this point. So, you see, as he, like, takes this coat off. You see these two, and they're leather like wings, right? Edward, you see like two dramatic. leather wings bound Sick. against his back. Fucked up tiefling. <laughs> and I like that unbind them more, so I can sleep. That makes more sense. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Just let your wings out and they'll just Love air it. dry, <laughs> you know. Give them, you know. I like go command her to just sleep. like a blast of air in her face. <laughs> <laughs> and then, like, just absolutely stunned. So then I go and I scoot the beds as far to the wall as I can. And I'm like, he's asleep. I'll, I'll, I'll address this later. Yeah, but just sleep now. Wings later. Okay. 
And I just get into bed and I like turn so I don't have to see him. Because yeah. I just I can't deal with it when I'm sleeping. You're not having a <laughs> it really is like having a gargoyle in your room while you go to sleep. Yeah. I'm just, he's like Yeah. At one point I just kinda get up in the middle of the night and I'm just like standing there. No, just standing in the middle of the room like Is he gonna eat me? Can <laughs> she wake up? Um I, I feel like I would definitely wake up. Would you well, yeah, I guess that makes sense if you're, like, on already on edge. Yeah. <laughs> the slightest movement, you're like, what yeah. job? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so at some point in the night, you do hear him, like, get up. I'm just looking mm-hmm. out the window. Just standing. And you turn, and you, like, peek over, and you, <laughs> see, you see unbound wings kind of, like, <laughs> hanging. No, like, they're, <laughs> like, they're, like, open. Like, they're, they're there. I'm just <laughs> peeking from the blankets. And I, like, turn around, and I'm like, <laughs> Try to smile and then just look back out the window. What you got there? What, why do you have those lies? <laughs> They're just well, there. I was born like this. Is that normal? No. Um, is there a reason? Like, do we do we know why? We don't. Do you? Yes. Can Can I also know why? No. Please. <laughs> Please. <laughs> <laughs> what, 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 what are you holding? Um, I, I would like to persuade him to tell me. <laughs> She's trying to persuade you to tell her why you have wings. I don't. No, he he won't tell. Um, you'd have to roll like thirty plus. Yeah, I'm not gonna look at that. Um. So um. Like he ha- he doesn't know her. That's at fair. All. Um. So. Do the wings help you in combat? You're a military guy, right? Yes. Are you allowed to have those in Garanian military? Not really. Did they make they make you cut off your horns? I the military didn't. Ah. Choice. Um, so the wings, did you just decide you wanted to keep them and not cut them off? I feel like that'd be painful, but like still. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't choose to. When you're trying to be polite, but you have <laughs> no, no, not my choice. Whose choice? No, not mine. It's not telling me anything. <laughs> um, so, <laughs> so, so, um, why do you, can you fly? Yeah, that's what they're for. Like, but sometimes they don't work. I, I, I honestly don't know anything about Performance this. issues, I, I get it. Performance not issues, me. yeah. I yeah. can perform. Um, Poetry book further into oh my god, this is more awkward than Tumson's date. We officially hit it. Dang, dang, dang. Oh, and, 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 and like, imagine this though. This is a dark in room. Okay? The standing. only light is coming from the lanterns and street lights out in mm-hmm. the city. You have a tiefling man with no horns. They're lopped off with leathery wings that are like out on his shoulders. And a tail lashing at his heels. And then Rina in the <laughs> corner. Like up to her fucking nose. And she's just glancing over like So what's that about? I just have so many questions. Ask all you want. Will you answer any of them? Yes, I'm not very tired. I have time. Okay. okay. Um Cinnabon's like, I'm fucking dying. Is this a crossbreeding just, just thing? FYI, Cinnabon. the first question you asked, he didn't answer. <laughs> exactly. Is this a crossbreeding thing? Like, your mother was a dragon. No. Are they, what kind of wings are they? None of my parents were tieflings. What? 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 Wait. What? What? That doesn't make no. sense. Neither. It does. Um, so who are your parents then? Oh, just folks. You said you were going to answer my questions. I, I don't like talking about my parents. Not, All right, not, let's not incredibly fond of my family. Okay. Um, how did you become a tiefling if your just parents weren't tieflings? Uh, <laughs> I was just born like this. Well, that was some very shocking. Hence yeah. the horns not existing anymore. Yes. Ooh, imagine birthing that. Ha 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 ha. Ow. <laughs> um, so, why do you pretend to have, uh, like... Wings don't go over well in Giron. So then why do you live in Giron? 
I never had the chance to leave. But I feel like this is 20 questions, but like hard mode. I, I don't even know what the right questions are to ask. Like, occasionally. <laughs> What's your, uh, I guess you don't go buck. What's your record for consecutive questions asked? 58. <laughs> um, so, okay, basics. Why do you want to be in this group? He pulls one of the beds over and sits down on it. Rin is like, <laughs> the wings are just there, and I'm just like... I said, <laughs> Tries to smile again. Why am I with this group? Yeah. Oh, you were there. They saved me. Well, yes, but why are you still with this group? I didn't have anywhere else to go, and they seemed like they could make money and needed someone you're, who could kill things, and I can kill things. You're a military guy. Like, wouldn't you have, like, the military? I never said I was a military guy. Oh, so that's a lie. I, a clever lie with outfits. I just like that jacket. Hmm. That's suspicious. Alright. Um. Lover's <laughs> <Reverse> jacket. Sun <laughs> Um. Do you have some sort of when she finds out purpose for dollar? being in Waterfail? No, I, I don't have much of a purpose at all, really, actually. It's quite sad. Oh, that was depressing. <laughs> you should read my, my poetry yeah, sometime. Which kind of approach? What kind of approach? Um, the trip suit. The sad kind. Umbrella Academy. I'm. I'm dealing with this. I don't deal with metaphysical often, and I've dealt with it more in the past I, six I'm, months than I've I'm ever. not metaphysical. I, I don't deal with it either. I'm from Gura. But wings. Uh, it's just something I was born with. It's like you having toes. They don't freak you out, do they? If no one else had toes but you did, they'd all be kind of scared. You wouldn't care. But you can fly. Yeah. 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 Wait. That'd be so good for surveillance. It is. You could go above everything and know the guard. I want wings. <laughs> he just kind of chuckles. You guys haven't actually really seen him ever laugh. He kind of laughs for oh. the first time. <laughs> Rina went from terrified to fuck. <laughs> to Sneak attack every round. I'm like, I'm like, I could just dive bomb, and they couldn't even stop me because I'm flying. Yeah, sometimes it really helps. You could like, you can, you could be flying, and then if I just fold my wings in, I kind of like, and then I just kind of, and then. That makes Candace that makes sense, fall. but also I'm afraid. Yeah, that's the right word. Yeah, it took some getting used to. Uh huh. Uh-huh. I'm process okay. Um He like crosses his legs. Yeah, I'm just sitting here and I'm like, I don't I don't even know what to do with this wealth of information. With this group, why wouldn't you have told them? I mean the they're all like magic users and Told them what? That you have wings. Oh I I did I, I showed them. We had to cross a poisonous river and I just flew right over. Oh. Yes, during my Doubt of absence. Yeah. They know. They know. I would kind of cut holes in the jacket and let the wings, but, you know, get on. You should leave, Garon. Yeah, Remember was telling me I should do that. I like Remember. She's yeah, weirdly she's nice. kind. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, um, I'm gonna... I'm going to go to bed because I think I'm going to pass out if I get any more um, information that I can't understand and didn't grow up with. I don't... The, I don't have anything else metaphysical. No? I can't even... Would she know that, like, tieflings can, like, cast, like, spells? Um... Like, innately? Not necessarily. Tieflings aren't super, like, common in Giron. Yeah, you might see them in some of the more, like, outer-lying okay. towns and stuff. There's just, there's nothing metaphysical about me. Okay. That's good. That's not, that's not bad. That's, metaphysical is not bad. It's just different. <laughs> Mantra to <laughs> Yes. Uh, metaphysical is not bad, just different. And I'm different. I get it. That's, that's okay, though. That's not bad, either. I mean, I grew up in circus style things so it's 
not unusual to be different in that. It's just, I didn't really realize how different people could be. I grew up different too, so. We should do more of those cons. If you could just fly away next time. <laughs> when we get out of Garan, yes. For sure. I mean. I had a lot of fun. What was that called? Acting, pretending, lying? Lying. Yeah. Which is oh, lying. Yes. <laughs> Acting, pretending, lying, performance. Face, theater. Yes. The theater. The theater. Um, okay. I think your wings are not bad. Thank you. I think you're not bad. Thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna go to bed now before I pass out. Okay, I, I won't, but don't, don't let that scare you. Can you not stare at me when I sleep? Yeah, I was looking out the window and then I, you woke just, up and then... I'm just I'm, making a general preference that I don't... I don't think I could sleep in those conditions. Yeah, it's fine. Are there like rafters? Huh? Are there like rafters? Uh, no, not on this okay, level. Right. Is there a beam that he could hang upside down from? <laughs> no, it's wow. just the ceiling. It's just a flat ceiling. Okay. That's, that's <laughs> okay. If Brita says that to him one day, like, so do you sleep upside down? Like, <laughs> hope that happens one day. Anyway, so that happens. I go and stare at the wall. How, the gonna, how are things going with Ingrod and Safine in what, the room? What time is it? Um, it was, it was after sunset. Like, it was not late evening, but... Like, 7.38-ish? About that, yeah. Okay. Um, I'm gonna take an hour. Okay. And cast my ritual. So nice. I'm gonna sit down. Okay. I am lighting some incense. I tell Safine, I'm, I'm going to be in this for, for about an hour. If you put the watch, just make sure that nothing happens. I want to be very aware. Um, I light the incense, and you'll see me. What does that mean? She just, like, owls <laughs> next to you. <laughs> it, like, is settled on the bed boy form, and he's just, like, eating. <laughs> Sweet boy. Um, so yeah, I'm just, <laughs> he's just like, sitting here casting. I draw the runes around myself that I need to draw, uh, and then I sit and I focus for about an hour of time. And when I'm done, the smoke from this incense rises up above it and kind of coalesces and forms. And I bring my hand up like this, and all of a sudden there's a raven sitting on my arm. Sophie even has a blanket over her head as she owls watching her. (laughs) And I look up, and I go, this is our new friend. I think you would be helpful. I don't have a name for you. I'll figure it out. I snap my fingers. Crow noises. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah, for me. Hell yeah. And I snap my fingers and he goes away. <gasps> He's a frumpkin! Yeah, He's a He's a There's a knock at the door. Okay. Oh, what? <laughs> okay. And then I like run over and I like. <laughs> and his is like. It's just. And he's like clenching his eyes shut and he's like, Mama, not working! It's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Just stay, just stay. Stay quiet. He's like, I'm gonna go this ball. And then he like puts the food down and he looks at you and he's like, wanna go this ball. Where did this go? <laughs> wow. <laughs> I can't even. And. She's like, oh wow. <laughs> he's like, <laughs> he's like, I can be visible too. Yes. Please hold. <laughs> I open like the door. Like, it's this is now a bad time. Oh no, it's fine. And I let you in and shut the door after you. And he, he runs over. I can be invisible. And then he like no closes secret. his eyes. What? I'm gonna, I'm gonna hide. She, she, oh no! <laughs> yeah, that's he, he closes like, his eyes and then when he opens them, he doesn't see Tams and he's like, oh, "Make Tams invisible." And then I'm gonna come from behind him and just go. And he's like. Can turn invisible too. Mama to know. <laughs> Mama to know. Wow. And then he just goes and sits down. Wow. <laughs> wow. That's so oh, I so to bat him on the head. <laughs> Did you need something? Uh yes. I wanted to talk to you and follow up um 
about what we discussed earlier. Oh, the metal the, 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 yes. Well, if this does nothing with me, then I have somewhere to be. <laughs> well, not, it but doesn't really story. matter, but if you have prior engagements, have a good Do time. Do you have a date with a unicorn? <laughs> <laughs> uh, the unicorn would not come anywhere near me, no matter what I would do. Yes, I know. And I enjoy uh, yours. I think whatever I do tonight would not help you fix that. Oh! But uh, she sashays away. Oh, so Have a good you. night. Whatever it is that you want to talk Be about. Be safe. Send a messenger if you can't come home. Yes, we'll you remember. You. <laughs> every little friend now. Goodbye. And she Chances out. Yeah, sure. Before she leaves the room, just a little bit prestidigitation, make sure she's nice and like tidy. Oh, Sabine is like, why did you have to go pee? Bow, 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 bow. And heading up to the address that Benevolence gave, it actually takes you up into the upper tiers. She a fancy one. Did Benevolence? I realize this is an involved can I duck into an alley and flip my corset to the other side? <laughs> yeah. Like I feel like Ingrid, I feel like Ingrid would start to see the changes and be like, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, and then like immediately duck and like flip it around and mm-hmm. and I think she's singed. probably got like one of her nicer scarves underneath a more plain one because mm-hmm. she likes to have something fancy but she has to be boring, so she like flips their order around so she has like a nice kind of gold filigree lace scarf on the mm-hmm. top and then her gold corset oh, as no, well. Oh no, you haven't had to get jiggy with it since you've got a knife. Yeah. <laughs> um, so she oh, looks yeah, a little yeah. bit nicer than she did <laughs> in the morning. Okay. <laughs> and there are certainly people like the lamps here glow with like different colored lights. There's like there's like a blue light like with a whole house that looks like this person just really likes blue, like blue different flowers and benches and like painted stones and everything. Like these like you've seen stuff like this in AdWords, but nothing quite quite like this. Like this is artistry and fashion on everything. It's not just clothes. And so you do eventually get to uh, Benevolence's house and a servant lets you in at the door and, uh, yes, the lady was expecting you and they let you in. And I do need you to roll performance, constitution, and (laughs) what was the other one? Constitution. You are in fact young. Oh, that's right. No, I think I don't know constitution is how long this is gonna go. Oh. oh. <laughs> like, it, performance, five, five, five. athletics, and constitution. <laughs> yes. Yeah, right. dexterity. Natural twenty on performance. Oh! <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yeah. Gonna that stick damn. with that die. Damn right. No. <laughs> Oh, what'd you do, bud? <laughs> natural one on athletics. No! <laughs> and what was the last one? And I constitution. Had... So, constitution. I did a sexy dance. Uh, constitution. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, it's gonna be a three for constitution. Oh, my God. So, you do a phenomenal it was a job. Good one. But one. she exhausts you real hard and. You do not show up at the end the next morning. Oh, <laughs> you, will be, you will be walking back sometime later. Hello. <laughs> but, of shame. but you. She fucking loved it. Oh, she had a great time. Yeah. Let it be known. Let it be like, known. not on my watch. Thank you very much. Okay, so, <laughs> Captain and Sabine. A natural 20's gonna kill Is that an athlete? My <laughs> name is Did you Legend. legend. Just <laughs> 20 for bad posts. Um, the name Giselle was written by you guys. I already bought some. Fuck. Okay, what do, uh, do, do I owe you for the supplies? Well, that's really I Thank you. Well, it's hard to say. It. I ended up actually bartering it. But mm-hmm. what were they charging you for? Um, 175? Or three? It was a lot. Yes, I think. Um, mm-hmm. It's. Yeah, it was 175, I think, for 30. Um, how would I do this, Sarah? Would I do, like, 
How much would it have cost her for the materials to make the stuff for me? Because the whole point was to make him double. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, you have enough components to make two one-ounce vials of each okay. that you did. But it will take four days for to it to brew. It. Yeah. Okay, so six potions, two of each kind, it'll take me four days. And, like, you can't move them or touch them. And I won't, I'll have to check back can in. Can she do you. one of each one at a time? Hmm? If can I'm she do make one a of... batch of something, I should make a batch of something. Alright. Well, perhaps do the sleeping one first? Okay. Because then you're only doing two. It will still take four days. Like oh, a four po days the potion per... takes four days. Okay, yeah. so if you're gonna start one, you can start another. Well, do, do you think it's okay to stop now? I do have some tension about starting a meth lab in an inn in a city and a country where they don't want me to. And it tastes that there's, it wasn't that bad because I was, like, contracted. What if you only do one potion? It'll still take four days. Yes, but you won't have to set up as much. It'll be easier to conceal. Yes, but this is also not a residence. This is an inn that we're... It's like, you know, we're like when you go to a hotel and you're like, Oh, what's a little bit of drugs? <laughs> Just, just put the thing on the door. Steven Tyler, you? Is that you? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Yes, but you did also say that you could do this. I can. I'm just going to brew it in your room. Nice. Brilliant. If you're interested in taking that risk. <laughs> Is there anywhere else we could do this? I told you. I literally told you. That this would take time. Also, it's only costing you 100 gold. Are we going to be here for four days? I could be. Probably. I think somebody's waiting on something for three days. True. How much room does it take? We could do it under my bed? We could do it under Remember's bed. Hers is much bigger. We could do it under Remember's bed. <laughs> yeah, this is going to go off so The sleeping good. one shouldn't have too many side effects on the wood, I think. She'll sleep well at night. Ah. That's... She'll think the bed is magical. We can put it at the foot of her bed. Hopefully she won't absorb that much from there. We'll just put it under the bed when we go out. This is going to go off so good. Yeah, all right. All it's, right. Uh... <laughs> I'll, I'll, um... Alright, so you guys go but... ahead and head back to Tamsin and Remembers. When she <laughs> finds the drugs, she's gonna flush them well, down. Well, is Remember, is like Remember, a officer. Is Are remember <laughs> awake right now? Oh, uh, hell no, no, I'm just saying, when this breaks bad. Are oh, you asleep? They're not drugs. Are you asleep right now? The In the bed? Or whatever. Oh. Yeah, what is Remember doing right now? Probably they're not drunks though. Yeah, probably. Well, tell was gonna tell she her. definitely had like a very like quiet moment where she was just like touching the bed and then she <laughs> sat down on the bed and then she laid down very stiffly on the bed and like doesn't really know what to do with it because she has hasn't slept in a bed in a really, really, really long time, and especially not one that fits her. So I think maybe, like, and she just got a fucking tattoo, so she's not, like, sleeping comfortably. She's definitely doing mm -hmm. that, like, half-in, half-out sleep that you do, and, like, there's something mm -hmm. going on that's wrong with your body. So she's not, like, out, but there's she's definitely in there. There's a demon lord standing in your room. <laughs> <laughs> um, would you wake up then when we came in? Um, yeah, probably. It's she's not dozing. illegal, technically, especially the sleeping one. It's just herbs. Okay. Uh, so we're gonna come into the room. Okay. Uh, with the equipment. Keep up. Re remember? What? We're oh. just making I was, I, was one, I was just checking to see if you were asleep. I'm not now. My, my apologies. Sh should we start tomorrow then? Start what? Well, um, Safine is gonna help me make some stuff to enhance a new fancy weapon 
I actually wanted to show you, but I didn't get a, a chance. I, we can do this tomorrow. En enjoy your slumber. Can we do this tomorrow? <laughs> Let's do this tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Oh, my boy, I left him in the room. <laughs> oh, my God. <goodness. laughs> you you, you did not leave him in the room. He happily followed you. Whatever uh, we yes. did, He's you are standing. doing. Don't get fucking caught. Have a good night. Fucking caught. No. <laughs> <laughs> and he, like, peeks over and he goes, Mom. And he's like, it's all gone. And he, like, holds the bowl gone. upside down. Good job. I'm proud of you for eating. Do you want to sleep? Are you still hungry? I wanna go outside! No. We're not going outside. Remember, just like scoops him up. I was about to say, like, she shuts the door on you. And she like, just like scoops him up and wraps him up, and he's like, he yeah. He wiggles not, for not a little going while. Anywhere. And he's going, no! It's time for bed. Go to sleep. No! Go to sleep. It's time for bed. If, if you want to be able to turn invisible, you need your rest. He goes, oh. And then he immediately goes still. Mom, too, is right. Go to sleep. <laughs> um, and then he just like and as he sleeps he changes back to dragon form. Sabine has a bottle of wine that Rena stole her from the previous inn yeah, and yeah, she's yeah. gonna yes. like you know that video where they like slap the top of the oh, wine bottle and yeah. shoot across <laughs> the That's her. And she's like, Yes, Same I watched brain. the boy for yeah for three hours and now it's mom's turn to watch him <laughs> and then drinks the whole bottle of wine. <laughs> I love that she's got this very classy bottle of Spin top one. <laughs> 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 oh no. Spin top. I only <laughs> steal the expensive stuff. Can Next I'll get you a box. Can I see the skyline? <laughs> yeah, you can definitely see the skyline. Because especially with how it's tiered, yeah. like you can see so like you can see the road that you guys came up. I don't really sleep, so in my restless during the restless night, I leave my room. Mm -hmm. Go outside. Mm -hmm. Can I make a perception check? Go ahead. Uh, 13. Okay. Um, you don't really see anyone. It's early enough in the morning that people who are out should not be out. Is it still dark of, out? Yeah. Oh, great. It, they're like skulking. Like You can see people who are like skulking. I am going sense. to go up. Okay. And up. And up. To the tallest spire I can find on the skyline. Okay. And then just sit there. Oh, and look out. And brood. <laughs> um, <laughs> and after a little bit, I'm just gonna kind of look up and I'm just gonna say, if there's anyone out there, well, up there, I guess. You know I shouldn't be here, but you let me be here. So, um, yeah. I could use a little more help. I uh, haven't had much ever, but somehow I survived, you know. So, I, the end, I guess. Don't know. Thanks. And you sit there for a little while longer, and what is your, do I have your perception here? Go ahead and roll perception. My passive is, my passive would be 13. Okay. And you can hear a rustle of wings. And you see a little crow sitting near you. Is this because you want to use your crow And it crow just noise? kind of like, no, I'm not actually going to use the crow noises here. <laughs> I have them all. I literally wrote down, like, what each one sounds like. <laughs> so I know which ones to use. But this little crow, he kind of, like, hops. And like looks one eye, looks the other, and then he flies off back into the city. Did it like seem like not a normal crow? It just. Okay. Yeah. Once it starts to kind of get light out, he glides back down. When he left the room, I woke up and I opened the window. Okay. <laughs> Thinking that he would come in and go. Yes. <laughs> she was like. I was, I was like. <laughs> I guess. Do I see the open window as I'm coming back to the inn? Um, it depends on how close you'd be flying to the inn. I mean, yeah, I'd, I'd have to okay. fly down to get there. Okay. Uh, yeah, you'd definitely see an open window. <laughs> I love our new character, YA love interest. 
To kind of like... <laughs> to stick the yep, yep, landing? Yeah. yeah, go for it. <laughs> Save face. 17 plus 7, 24. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, so you... So you, like, eat it as you get into the room. And then, like, Rinna is upright. Yeah. Like, a, like a fucking spring. And you just are like, Yeah, no, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> it's fine. I'm good. The, the bruise? The bruise? And the scratch, and you're good? I ran into a flock of birds. Oh, sky. yeah, I bet. They come out of nowhere. It wasn't the window, right? No. no. Close the window. <laughs> Lay back down on the floor. <laughs> and think about the crow that I saw. Okay. Um, <laughs> a flock of birds. So, <laughs> remember sleeps. Snuggled up with his. Um, Tamsin and Safine. Are you brewing drugs in Safine's room? <laughs> no. There are Okay. Okay. Right. She's not gonna get per se. No, the sleeping potion li- it's clinical and she doesn't have a license to do so, but she, it's a misdemeanor. Is, she's is that what you're, she's is, not gonna get any time. Is that what you set up Elf in your room? She's gonna do the same. <laughs> okay. Bring down. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna she's like find a closet. <laughs> okay. Unbelievable. There's there is like a chest of drawers a kind of thing. <laughs> I'll put it in there. Just use a drink and use sign. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Imagine an orc. No housekeeping. <laughs> Okay. We're looking at 25 to life, brother. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so remember goes to sleep, snuggled up with his. Tamsin and Safine, are you chilling in Safine's room I for like the night? I like pop, pop, set it and forget it and then pop that like bottle of wine open and was like, yeah, no, She went back to the room herself. I okay. stayed there when she left. Pop, pop. Okay. So this so abuse is a problem, guys. <laughs> She's literally yeah. drinking while she's And then, like, and right Aaron now. is yeah. asleep at Benevolence's house. Oh, no. hey. And uh, asleep. Short do, rest only. Do we <laughs> want to? Do y'all want to keep going, or do we want to wrap it up here? It is midnight. Is it Yeah, it's midnight. I'm trying to fight something. I'm good to keep going. But I'm okay. It's up to the sleepy ones. No. Um, Raise your hand if you want to keep going. Okay, that's fine. Okay, <laughs> so let's take a quick break for like food and restroom breaks and stuff like that, and then we'll and jump, next day <laughs> we'll jump back into the recording. So this is going to happen within the following four days because you have weapons to get, things that are going to take time. So, what are y'all doing in the four days that you are just in Waterville? I'm actually going to go look for a newspaper. Okay. If they have that. Is that a thing? Yes, but not in the lower tiers. Okay. A farm to see newspaper. Well, I'm going to see if anyone wants to come with. Is this so real life? At some point, I'm gonna show. <laughs> remember my cool new needle thing. It's, it's cool. my, my cool Frederick new needle Saturn. thing. Cute, cute, cute. Ooh, she cute. appreciates weaponry too. Yeah, let's do a like sparring weapon practice. Ooh. We just like throw down and have a good time. Twilight style. Okay. I was gonna go find a bar to fight somebody. Twilight but softball but game style. I like that. Twilight one. Eclipse. Okay. So, so you guys need to kill remember the new kind of have style. like a train. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> it would probably be best to be headed <laughs> out of the city right? proper to do that. Yeah. Um, we can't really the court here, but like, <laughs> it's the southern They play. definitely be like, what the fuck are y'all doing with that? <laughs> like, like it's, style. Mm-hmm. it's a little too, it's much more proper. Like, they, like, weapons testing in the middle of the city would be, like, real bad. So, so you guys go ahead and head out of the city proper. Um, after kind of like asking around about that kind of thing and people are like, oh yeah, like, you know, we, you can go out and to the fields and stuff like that outside of the city. And 
there's the option of going down to the quarry, there's like farmland, or there's just like the hills and fields around the road. What do you think? Um, suppose I listen to where these locations. <laughs> you said there is a hill. Yeah, there's very, like the, the hills around the road. Mm-hmm. Is it there's, just you guys? Or did you tell everyone? You want to come with? I'm always down to practice. Let's go yeah. fighting. Yeah. I'm going to go fight. All right, so is everyone kind of going to take a sparring day then, or is Safine chilling back behind? She'll watch. Okay. So you guys go ahead and head out. Are you heading towards the hilly area around the road, the quarry, or farmland off towards the north? Should we go to the quarry? I feel like that's probably going to be more remote. There is also... Uh, Rinna and Claudius would inform you um, a river stretching along the western side of the city. Ooh, river. Why do you think the quarry? I, didn't, I just think it could be less because I feel like the hills are open and visible. Uh, I People think see us. we should go to the river. I don't much enjoy the quarry. Alright. Why? What's wrong with the quarry? I just don't like it very much. What do they mine there? That's a terrible answer. Oh, they mine lots of things. Uh, I wouldn't know much about it, though. Okay, this was very beneficial to me. Do you want to go to the (laughs) river? I suppose so. I guess we're going to go do that now for no reason whatsoever. (laughs) Then we could just go to the quarry. quarry. I mean, we've had some... Interesting stuff happened where people are mining things. You know what? I have a feeling that you're going to kick my ass, so we're going to the hills so I get some advantage over you. So you go out in the open a little bit more? Mm-hmm. Okay. Right. And remember, it's gonna like, um. There probably wouldn't be. I'm trying to think what we could take out for target practice. Well, Thameson's just gonna work on his, like, hand to hand combat. Oh, hand to hand combat, okay. Yeah. I thought you said you wanted to show her the. Well, I said at some point he would... Yeah. So I figured it was probably the next morning when she woke up. Okay. At some point during the day, he was just like, hey. Okay. Um, to explain kind of what was going to be happening in the bedroom at some point. As far as making... Yay! Yeah. <laughs> <Ew. laughs> nice. <laughs> making things. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that didn't make it any better. No, 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 sure. Exactly. I feel like I'm the live studio audience. Like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, Tony needs to work on his hand to hand combat. So, and a very big, strong, and still skilled fighter would be a good person to hell practice yeah. with. So when they get out to the hills, remember, takes. Um, what, what do I have left? Um, she's going to take. There's like a pointed part at the bottom of her shield. And she takes it and just shoves it into the dirt and then draws this really big circle around them and, like, tosses the shield away and, like, drops the rest of her gear outside of it. All right. We're going to do this the way that we do it in Broly. I'm going to teach you something about how I fight, okay? Just your hands, not your feet. Don't fucking use your feet. They'll be really pissed about it. Like, sit cross-legged on a hill. <laughs> like, mm. No, I fly up to a tree branch and I watch That's from there. <laughs> I'm watching from the ground. And now I'm doing cartwheels. Yeah, many, many, um, <laughs> She's like martial studies that focus on just. Um, <laughs> I'm sitting underneath the tree, ne- but like opposite of him. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I really yeah. want to say we're freaking Thailand right style, <laughs> but like uh, she just thinks of like handstands. But that is not solely <laughs> arms. Yeah. Traditionally, solely arms. It's okay. Um, so first one on the ground or out of the circle loses. Sumo style. <laughs> any any other rules? Don't break anything, I guess. We want to be Kill each other. Up. I mean, we could heal you, so you could break stuff. Who's we? Oh, I, I thought <laughs> you meant like... I was going to say, I didn't think there was anything <laughs> around here to break. Oh, well, don't... But don't you break. meant each other. Yeah, yeah. I see. So That's so usually not rule, so but I like, think we're both. She could she could break him now. Durable. I think she could step on him and snap him. Just start bending. Come up yes. to the tree. Yes, yes. yes. Okay, I see what you don't know. Remember, <laughs> 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 I just had to climb there. Like eight foot flat, I think. 
Remember's eight foot. Uh, your Tenzin is like mm. three three. <laughs> my mom's on he's like he's is. like. Do the size of my shoe. She, <laughs> she choosing hand to hand yeah. without any kicking is not an advantage for her because if she could have kicked, she could actually reach him. <laughs> well, the problem is I roll like shit, so every time I do this, it's just like a fun exercise for whoever I'm doing this with. <laughs> and um, how you're That's going to do right. this is it's going to be One unarmed strikes for both of you, mm-hmm. um, and it's going to be you your AC minus your armor to the pain. AC so tens of wins, you each get half a copper. Mm. So, <laughs> so like, so like, your armor brings you up to I twenty. Oh what is it? <laughs> <laughs> We're all sitting on you. No. <laughs> like, I think it started at twelve. Do you think we can interfere and make it Question well, mark? Yes. Like if I just loaded I'm the gun sure. with just the black powder, but didn't like shoot. Them. Whatever. I'll say it's just a noise. Okay. Scared them the fuck. And then tell them whatever yours is without armor. I don't know where armor. Hey, Sarah. How's your armor? How is your AC nineteen? Because of monk. Oh, exactly. Because, because monk. monk. <laughs> Excellent I'm choice. I'm just gonna load my pistol with just powder. Okay. <laughs> Again. <laughs> I love that Rita and Claudius are sitting there and like. We're betting on it. Yeah, we're Don't be suspicious. It. Don't, Don't be suspicious. <laughs> Don't be suspicious. <laughs> so, am I keeping my? Uh, armor yeah, plush? you're. Okay. Yeah, that's your and unarmored. That's the point. He's unarmored, mm-hmm. so he has the unarmored bonus. I feel like yours wouldn't be twelve. I, feel like I know. I was gonna say higher yeah. than that. Yeah. Let's just say fifteen. Okay. We'll say. Yeah. What's your normal armor? I don't know. I don't remember what it was. But with because the, the shield's just plus two. Well, no, she also wears uh, a scale mail. Okay. Oh, Fancy yeah. armor. It's, scale it's mail just ten plus shield. your dex if you take your armor off. Or whatever our DM says. Yeah. <laughs> that usually yeah, works. No, ten plus my dex would be twelve. I'll take the fifteen. Thank All right, you. cool. <laughs> All right. If I want to have any prayer of this going well for her, <laughs> if I lose, it's gonna be because she just got a full back tattoo. <laughs> she did though. She just got a magic full back oh, tattoo. Oh, that's really really cool because then they, she like tosses all of her gear off and then you can see the gold on the back. Yeah, nice. it's like yeah. glinting no. in the sun. Hell yeah! Is this the first time I get to see it? Yeah. Are we allowed to interfere? It's a nice, nice piece. I'm gonna, what are you gonna do? Sweet, it looks good. <laughs> I had something added yesterday. I'm not much good. Uh, what, what was that? Long oh, distance gold. combat. Oh, oh, That's actually oh, a nice skill, touch. Thank you. This is actually pretty cliche and really and Everybody in their cousin has this tattoo. <laughs> I don't know what it would do. <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna tie some rope to like the tree branch in front of us and like tie a knot. Shall and I'm gonna start to doing extend? acrobatics on it for kicks. Yes. Nice. So <laughs> just like I'm just, aerialist. In yeah, I'm aerialist. actually yeah. She, I'm just freaking aerialist. She thing. just suddenly like Sabine. You watch as Rena seems to just kind of be like chilling. And then suddenly she like has this rope thing set up and she just starts doing aerial stunts. She's <laughs> literally what's her name from Avatar? Tylee. Cricket. Yeah, for sure. Good. That's one hundred percent who she is. Oh, and I may. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So go ahead and start your sp- so. <laughs> are you talking if Thames and Wins I get two copper? Um, no. If Thames and Wins we get each get half a copper. Wait, if if you remember, on? I'm betting on Tenzin. If I remember wins, remember. she gets two copper. Oh. And we both Yeah. That's why so you bet on the underdog. Yeah. Yeah. So at the, at the beginning of their spy match, I'm betting a silver now. Do, you've seen I'm them do it to greet people before, and, and it's kind of like. <laughs> They're both betting copper still. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, no, like I'm definitely betting a silver. Karate, but it's a little bit different, and there's a specific way he places his hands, and then he kind of bows at you and then readies. Mm-hmm. She like and looks at the way that your hands are, and she kind of like holds her hands up for a second and then just. Okay. <laughs> are we like rolling initiative or what are we doing here? Uh, I mean, that's really up to you guys. This is your fight. Usually when we do bar brawls, yeah. it's just. Okay. Yeah, so yeah. just, you can just roll to see who is like beating who. Huh? Let's do it. Wait, I'm confused. What? So basically, see who beats whose AC first. And then that's who gets the first hit. So I got an A. <laughs> Why do you roll so bad? I got 19. So... Oh, uh, 26. Yeah. Oh, do you want a different die to roll with? These aren't even mine. 
These are like your third pair. Thanks, thanks, bud. Here, I'll take this one. Okay. We need to take it to the dice shop. It's not gonna do anything. <laughs> oh. It's bad. Been there. Mm. How do you kick my ass? Um. Told you. Go ahead. I'm a ten.